Hello, welcome to LEV Toys. Today we are going to build Olivia's house, one of the very original Lego Friends releases back in 2012. I bought this set back then and it has been built four or five times or rebuilt four or five times in that time. So we're going to rebuild it again today. It comes with two books and seven bags. So there are lots of pieces in here and there are three minifigures. So the first one is Olivia. Here she is in her trademark outfit. There we go with her light orange eyes and her brown hair. And I think we're all pretty familiar with what Olivia looks like now. We're gonna pop her over here. This set also comes with Olivia's mum in her three quarter length red skirt and her red Mary Janes and a very attractive top and her head which has got blue eyeshadow and very bright red lipstick and a fantastic little haircut here a black bob there we go you come and stand over here next to olivia and we'll get olivia's dad out as well now this was the first boy well man mini doll and he's got he's come home from work obviously he's relaxed his tie he's got a bit of five o'clock shadow and some brown hair here and he's ready to come and barbecue up a storm for dinner. However, there's a problem because we haven't built the barbecue yet. So let's start building. We're not starting with the barbecue because that's right near the end. So let's start doing the very first room. This is, or will be, the living room. So let's go. can see these very quaint little windows here. If you've seen the Emma's house build, you'll see that it's a much more modern build than this one. This is a, a, a very old fashioned, um, picturesque, cottagey type house. It's certainly got its charm though. Here, Olivia's out here and she's gonna check as we add just a bit of decoration to the front yard, the three pretty roses and they do smell lovely. That's what she told me anyway. I don't know, she didn't actually tell me that. And now we're gonna build some of the furniture for inside. So here is the television with a, uh, looks like it might be a fashion show on it. And it has a little bit of rotation ability. It sits in the corner. And this is the swiveling armchair. And it swivels itself over here and Olivia's gonna sit in it and try not to slide out of it. And she's gonna watch the fashion show while I build the lounge, which will comfortably seat two mini dolls, so that'll be perfect for mum and dad. There, and that goes in this corner, and there's mum, and there's dad. Perfect, and they need a coffee table with a pretty vase of flowers, and we've just knocked dad and mum out. There, there, so they're all watching the fashion show, and I will continue and build the next room. And this one is the kitchen and the front entryway. So this is where the front door is. Olivia would like to keep watching. So she's had enough of the fashion show for now. She can watch and she can tell me when I make mistakes, which happens all the time. So there we go, there was the first one. And there we have some postcards up on the wall inside and all of the cooking things. There's a ladle and some herbs and a cloth there's another sweet little window and there's the front light at the front door and a matching one on the other side and there's the door there with a very bright and cheerful yellow doorknob Excellent, it's coming along very nicely. We need a couple of black connectors. We'll move Olivia over and we'll put some flowers in and two lady beetles in the garden. And now I think you might wanna open the door, Olivia, and you can go inside, stand up. There. And we're going to start building some of the cool furniture that's on the inside in the kitchen. So we have a kitchen counter with a couple of drawers underneath. And we're gonna keep the cutlery in this top drawer. So we got these fantastic little Lego knives and forks, two forks and two blue knives. And they fit in there just perfectly. And then on top of there, this is a nice feature. It's a blender for smoothies. <laughs> and now we have got the sink at the front for washing up all of the mess in the kitchen. 
and right down here is the oven and it's got a baking tray in it and hot plates for the pan. There are lots of cool little accessories in this, lots of cute little bits and pieces and you all know I love bits and pieces. A mixing bowl uh, and a mixer as well, an electric mixer. We might move the mixing bowl over here and the mixer can sit right next to it just as it should. And there's a little muffin tray, a little muffin patty pan ready to put the muffin mix in. And on the other side, of course, we need somewhere to keep that milk cold. It's a refrigerator. Did you guess? I bet you did. It's even got some little green shelves on the outside. And on the top, it's got a salt and pepper shaker. And there is only room, yeah, I know Olivia, it's not, not incredibly economical because it's only got enough room for one carton of milk. But that's okay. We'll keep everything else somewhere else, I don't know. And also the dining table with three little stools. And there's a cupcake and a couple of plates and some a cherry and an apple. There. So that is the two bottom floor rooms. And they have snapped in together. Let's have a look at them. There. So mum and dad, come and stand over here while we start on the first floor for the next level. Now this one is Olivia's bedroom and it's got a gorgeous little balconette on it with climbing roses. Can you see them there? There are the roses. And here are the structural walls. And she's got two big glass doors in here but they don't open at all so I don't know how she gets out onto the balconette. It's just there for decoration. And a little cat comes with this, the cutest little cat called Kitty. And Kitty's just going to sit here on the balcony and yeah, give Kitty a lovely pet. And inside, it's time to start putting Olivia's room furniture together. So this is her dressing table. She's got a little mirror there, which is logical because you need to look in the mirror to make sure you've got everything on properly. And it's got a row of lights above it and some pretty bits and bobs on the side, a brush and a lotion bottle maybe and, and perfume. She can sit there and the cat's gonna come and meow and crawl all over her while she's trying to use the dressing table because that is what cats do. And on the other side is the bedside table with a lamp. And this, this will be Olivia's bed. Excellent. All right, Olivia's bed, just here, and she's got a very pretty handbag and her secret lock diary, and look, the cat's right on the bed, because once again, that is what cats do. And we're going to put this up here on the second story. There, that's starting to take beautiful shape, but we still need a whole heap more rooms. So let's do the next one, which is on the second story as well. This one is the bathroom. And this has got some cool features as well. I like the tiles here. You've got blue and white sequenced tiles a checkerboard. That's a nice combination there. And you can see the sticker there, you've got a little rubber ducky and all the things you're going to need in the shower because that is the corner for the shower. Some more windows just like we've got downstairs, which is good because you need windows in the bathroom to let all that steam out. And here comes Olivia, she's going to stand over here while we build, actually that goes on there, we build up the rest of the top up here. There. Now we've got the shower head. So we're just going to stand poor Olivia under there. There we go. But there's no actual shower screen yet. And that's these dinky looking things here. Look. So you snap these two together. And there. That's the shower screen for one side and that will extend that far. And then there's another one on the other side. There, hold on, that's not in properly. There we go. And now if we, if we just push Olivia over a little bit, here, hop out, hop out. You're obviously not ready for a shower, but we can seal those together so that the water doesn't get out everywhere. And now we've got the bathroom basinette for washing our hands at the sink and the mirror. And of course, every bathroom needs a toilet. There we go, and she's testing it out for comfort while we put it up here next to the bedroom. So there, we're doing so well. We've got four rooms done so far. We are up to some of the roof parts. So this is the rooftop balcony. It's got an umbrella 
and a little swiveling chaise longue to lie on up there in the sun. There we go. And that Olivia is going to try that out. And we need a little bit of token greenery just to make it look a bit colourful and gorgeous up here. And there's a butterfly up here as well. There. She's going to enjoy the sun. And look, see, cat's right here. Right, we'll leave Kitty and Olivia up there to enjoy the sun while we build the roof. Go, lots of fuchsia coloured pink parts on this roof. That's really hard. Oh, there we go. I've put them in the wrong spot. They are really hard to snap on there. Look, look, they're all sitting up at the bottom. Here we go. Really hard snaps. There we go. Now they're on. Goodness, that was tricky. And a butterfly on the chimney. Another token butterfly. There are butterflies everywhere here. Butterflies and lady beetles. Lots of flowers. And there, that's the entire house structure. And doesn't it look fantastic? It really is very charming. We'll put the cat back on the balcony. But now we've also got a whole heap of garden to build. So this is the garden that comes outside the front door. Here's our front walkway with checkerboard grey pieces. And look, there's even a garden bed with carrots growing in it. And the mailbox with mail in it. And a cute little picket fence, a white picket fence with a couple of little garden lights out the front. There. Come down the Come down the pathway, check the mailbox. Yes, there's mail in it. Yeah, I already knew that because we just put it in there. You stand over here, Olivia, and we will build the next part of the garden, which is a pretty cute feature. This, this is a bit fun. This part is a swing. So we need the bar along the top to make the swing s do its swingy bit. And now we need the swing seat so that the swingers have got somewhere to sit. There. What do you think, Olivia? I think it works pretty well. <laughs> More decoration. More white picket fencing. And a bit more greenery. And now we need the barbecue, because every outside garden area needs a barbecue. Look at that cute little blue spatula. This is the barbecue top. There, and there's the barbecue in the corner, and there's a chicken leg busy roasting on it. But we still have more garden to build. And there's a picnic table outside with a large red sausage on it, and a drink and a sauce dispenser. And of course we need a sunflower, because sunflowers just grow everywhere and they're incredibly cheerful. There. So that's all the garden. Come out here. Come out here, Olivia's dad. And you can hold the spatula and you can keep an eye on this chicken leg and make sure it doesn't burn because Olivia's mum's coming out. She's going to stand here. She's got another job to do. We have to build something for her. Can you guess what it is yet? Because all that grass is terribly long. She needs to do some mowing. I don't think she's really dressed appropriately for mowing, but it will just have to do. There we go. Off you go. You go and do a whole heap of mowing. Mo mo mo. So that's it. That's the entire build. You can rearrange this and put the floors in whatever order you like. You can put them all on top of each other if you want. There are so many choices of ways you can set this up. It really is a fun little house. It's actually a buildable doll's house, which I think is really, really cool. Oh look, there's Olivia. She's relaxing on her bed, reading her secret diary, and Kitty's snuggled in next to her. Oh, and she's off to use the bathroom through that little connecting door there, but she hasn't noticed. Yep, Daddy's already in the shower. He's fully clothed, but he's in the shower, so off you go. And now they're having an interesting dinner of red sausage and apple and cherry and muffin. And now the Kitty's climbing up on the roof. Ah, oh, she's chasing the butterfly. Oh dear, and now she's stuck on the roof. So Olivia's going to come and get her. Here we go. Silly kitty. Here we go. 
There we go. Come on, kitty, back down off the roof. Down here. Pop kitty out the front. There we go. On to the mailbox. And now you can check that mailbox again, I think. Might be time to get the mail out, hey? It's been in there for long enough. And there, mail is collected. Oh, it's swing time. That is a cool swing. Oh, mummy's on the swing. And Olivia's pushing her. And Olivia, not too rough. Ah! <laughs> it's a full circle swing. Oh, daddy's turn. Yep, Olivia. Yep, where are you? All the way around. Uh, oh, and they're all on the swing, including the kitty. <laughs> okay, that's too many people on the swing. And now they're in all sorts of strange places on the swing, including upside down. Well, they are having fun. They do say a family that plays together stays together. So they, I think they're going to stay together, having a wonderful time. Daddy's busy picking his carrots and they're waving you goodbye. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe, click like, leave me a comment and I'll see you again for another video very, very soon.